I got Yarley Kennedy and Camilla, right? Camilla. Camilla over here next to me. And uh man, they almost had me. I got back on the board. <laughs> All right, guys. So just kind of do a show opening here. We'll start with this thing. Look at that. Beautiful fish. I'm gonna keep some for pictures and then I'm gonna give them give the rest of these over to Yarley. But guys, we are on Lake Merval in Texas. I decided to come to a new location this time. Um, never fished this lake, so uh, met them at the boat dock, kind of followed them out, and kind of a stumpy lake, wasn't quite sure what to expect. It's gonna be a good time, guys. So y'all stay tuned. Let's try to pull some big old fish in this boat. Can't wait, go stay tuned. I'm an American. All right, guys, so uh, as you can tell, we're on a brand new lake. Um, I shot a shot this video with a brand new camera, and as you can tell, I had a wireless mic on there, but the wireless mic was not set up correctly. Uh, turns out these GoPros, you have to, with this type of mic, you have to go in and do a couple settings or it doesn't work. Um, the transmitter, I looked at it, the transmitter was doing fine, but the video or the audio was not recording on the camera, so yeah, anyway, it didn't work real well. But uh, we had a good day at the lake. Um, I did a lot of talking from a distance and um, you didn't get all my my audio so there's no prayer on this one um, but it, I think the whole video kind of kind of shows speaks to what I was doing out there. Uh, so y'all enjoy it. Um, it wireless mic issues fixed it'll be back on the next video so y'all stay tuned. There we go. Ready? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Not a big one, but nice black. Black? Yes, sir. All right, we recording here. Let's make sure. All right, we're recording. Look at this, guys. First black. Lake Merval. <laughs> Put a few in here for pictures and we're gonna let them go all right guys so we got a uh, right now 66 degree water temperature fishing in about eight and a half foot of water using the 12 foot acc mid seat uh, using get to it using a 1 8 ounce jig head unpainted with a bonehead stump bug palestine special on there so um those of y'all have not seen what I do, I put a slip weight on the top, do a swivel in the middle, about two foot leader. The reason I'm doing this, um, probably need to decrease that uh, leader right now, but what I'm doing is in live scope, especially when you have a bunch of fish in there, you can see two different, different items moving up and down. Really helps you find your bait and focus on what where you are. Um, <clears throat> second thing is fishing this kind of uh, stuff when I get to say Tennessee and it's all brush piles for instance I'm gonna use a lighter line because I don't want to pull the brush pile up but I'm fishing stumps here I'm fishing trees that are in the ground I'd rather be able to pull out bend my jig a tad bit and and rebend it when it comes out so that's kind of why I'm doing this setup
steps. All right, guys, another little bitty one. I think he's legal. Let me check. Legal fish. Where'd you get that one? Oh. Not the one I was targeting, you guys. <laughs> but pretty little fish, for sure. Going back. Mm -mm. That's what I love about these crappie at this time of year. Let me show you. Look at those colors. Beautiful fish. Let's put them back. Guys, we got a bunch of trees out here, but this sucker was was roaming. Come on, jigs in the wrong spot. He was not coming off. Nice black. A couple more down there with him. Take a look. All right, guys, so uh, just kind of give you an idea. Let me show you what else I'm doing. So here's another deal that I'm looking at. So I've been over here. Uh, I'm going to go check this area out right here. So there's no skiing, danger, stumps. Uh, you can see right there, 13, 12, just does gradual work its way up. And they're probably spawning up in there, I'm assuming. And so I'm going to go try that area real quick. If not, they got another spot over there. That's kind of how I'm breaking this thing down. Just looking at these contour lines. We get. No, I want to leave that on there because I want to see what I'm. I don't know. I don't know this lake. So I don't know if I'm in stumps yet or not. It doesn't look like it. But anyway, I'm gonna give it a shot up here. Once I see a couple stumps, then I'll start fishing. Beautiful black crappie. Wow. Mm. Okay, so I know those are black crappie down there. Guys, these are not just huge fish, but they're good eaters. That one may be a little small. Go ahead and chunk him back. <laughs> I 
can't get this stuff, guys, on Active Captain. I can show you the tree I'm fishing, but I got him right in the bottom of the lid, too. He's an eater. All right, I'm going to go ahead and go somewhere else where I can... I'm sure I can catch more fish out of here, but let's see if we can't find a couple bigger ones. How do we get catfish off? Just like this. Was not targeting him. Alright everybody. Say hi to Yardley. And Camilla. I keep trying to say Camilla. <laughs> Alright, I got. Oh, hold up a couple, Chris. Let me get a picture. Find a couple of these big ones. Oh. Oh, man. Okay. Woo! Come on, oh man. <laughs> Come get out. Oh, come on. <laughs> Jokers? Well, yep, you'll do. That's the result of having a good live oil. Yeah. Not bad for the first time here. No, no, man, that's great. Trust me. Oh, Chris. Oh, Which one, honey? Did you, did you, uh, did you weigh this one? I didn't weigh it. That's nice. Woo! So, guys, it's been a great day at the lake. I've got uh, Yardley and Camille over there, and they showed me around a little bit, and then did a little research. I'm gonna go probably do back, go back and do a little more research on. Uh, what's it called, uh, Google Earth, and take a look at lake levels and stuff like that, but anyway, it's been a good time. I think we caught about uh, 16 crappie total, not uh, counting the ones I threw back, a few uh, catfish, but all in all, I'm pretty impressed with this lake. It's been a good time, so it is time now to head back to the house and check out this footage so anyway guys if y'all would if you haven't done so already hit that like button subscribe let me know what you think about it in the comments and we will catch you on the next show have a good day